Okay, it's 7 a.m. We put the canopies up yesterday. We have an uh, hour to go before we start uh, registering kids. So it's time to go ahead and get everything set up. We got a different set of volunteers. Some of the same guys from yesterday, but lots of new ones here helping us get ready right now. You just want two at the volunteer booth or what? Yeah, I want two over there. Two, uh, right underneath the canopy. Two, two, two for the pre reg yeah, two for the pre-reg. Okay, we got a bunch. And two here, and then we need three at the volunteer station. Okay. Uh, we don't need the generator. We have guys. Good. Okay, let's run an extension cord from there to here. Okay, guys, right over there in front of the green table. Now it's setup time. Here's Monica running. All right, here's all the people helping out. We have some high school students volunteering today. Okay, we have. 25 minutes now before we start. We got people in line already over there. And we got all canopies up, tables just arrived, chairs just arrived. Our volunteers are here. Hi everybody, here at El Dorado Park. It's eight o'clock now, so everybody's starting to register. And over here you see our registration area. We got people there, people in line. And then we even have more people. Right here, Hey guys. <laughs> and we have all these people over here doing the registration forms. So once they do the registration forms, then they'll get in this line. And after they get in that line and they do the registration, they get the wristbands and all the other info. And then they're ready to go fishing. This is a pre-registration area. So everybody here is filling out their forms. Hey, how you doing? Where's Good. the fish at, Dan? Yeah. Uh, I don't know. Brother Dan. Good morning, Dan. Hey, guys. Say good morning, my friend. Thanks for coming out. So this is the pre-registration area. All the families are doing the paperwork. Yeah. It's all... Each child. Every child has that paperwork done. And once they get done with this, then they can all go fishing. So have you been here before? Yeah, came a couple years back when I was under the age. Uh, did you catch any fish? Yeah, limited. Oh, yeah, limited? Full limit. Cool. Yeah, so. so you brought some kids out today? Yeah, my little sister and brothers. Cool. Niece. So hopefully they get to do the same. Cool. Well, thanks for coming. Right. Thank you. Thank you so, so you enjoyed it as a kid coming to Foundation yeah, events? I loved it. You loved it? Yeah. I want to uh, volunteer. Cool. Yeah, we can always use volunteers. Check with Monica afterwards. Okay. Or uh, I'll give you my card and just... Go to the website too, yeah. and just uh, send an email and we'll get you all registered. Okay. Yeah. Alright, thanks man. Alright, good luck. Fishing with Santa, 5 to 15. Yeah, that's a uh, couple weeks. Zach, he's a 
fan of mine, and he's out here with his dad for our kids event. So, do you watch a TV show? Every Saturday. Yeah, every Sunday. Saturday? Sunday. All right, cool. Sunday morning. Cool, so he watches it Saturday and Sunday on KDSVN, on PBS, and so what are you going to try to get for it? What are you going to try to catch today, catfish or trout? Catfish. Catfish? Okay, well, they're both here, so good luck. Thank you. All right. It's 9 o'clock, and uh, first off, I'd like to welcome you all to the city of Long Beach, El Dorado Park, for their annual fishing tournament, or derby. Uh, there is no prize for biggest fish, so what we do is at lunchtime, we'll have a drawing. Every kid will be in the drawing, as long as they have their wristband on. So make sure all kids are registered, and with that registration, the kids will get a free lunch, and you can uh, get bait from us too, or any fish and tackle that you may need. All right, so it's nine o'clock. Let's start fishing, everybody. The lake is now open. Thank you for being here. <laughs> See, it doesn't change your mind now. This is Patrick. He's out here with his family, and he caught this catfish. Is this your very first catfish? Have you caught him before? No, first one. Your very first catfish? All right, hold him on so everybody can see him. There's Patrick out here. Is this your first time fishing? Mm-hmm. Your first time fishing too? Cool. So this is exactly what this program's all about: introducing kids to fishing, to fishing. And for Patrick, this is his very first time fishing, and he's here at one of our youth foundation events. And here's this fish. Let's keep it away from the water. And he's never ever been fishing before. And he caught his first catfish. Congratulations, man. Thank you. How'd it feel? Good. Ready to go get another one? Yeah. All right. Nice fish. Congratulations, Patrick. Thank you. Hold on. Your drag is very loose. Thank you. Get up a little bit. Go down and then back up, Rando. Yeah, baby! Right. Damn, Woo! huge. <laughs> nice job. There you go, Miranda. Woo! You gonna kiss it? Hopefully. Yeah. You gonna kiss it? <laughs> Get it away from the water in case right. it slips out of your hand. Yeah. Oh, yeah. So, this is Miranda. I don't know if you've ever seen any of our YouTube videos, but we had an episode where she came out fishing with us with her dad over here and uh, she caught her very first bluefin tuna and they came up you guys are from San Diego aren't you? No, you uh, live up here? from Inland Empire. Oh Inland Empire. So they came over to Long Beach to fish with us and she caught another fish. Little catfish here. Yeah that's nice. Have you ever caught a catfish before? Uh, no I believe this is my first time. <laughs> so I was with you when you caught your first tuna mm -hmm. and when you caught your first catfish. Yep. <laughs> Maybe you gotta fish with me more often. Yeah, definitely. <laughs> yeah, that's good. All right, congratulations. Thanks, Dan. And when it was so funny when she was catching the tuna, we had to drag her dad to the bow of the boat because he was so nervous and making her nervous yeah. that we didn't even let him stand next to her. We drug him up to the bow of the boat and the skipper worked with her and I was standing next by, close by, and she caught another fish. Yep. Good job. Thanks, Dan. Good job. All right. This morning we're, we're having trout and catfish, so I've got mealworms, marshmallows, and mackerel, and a little bit of trout bait. So we have a nice mixture, so whatever the people can, uh, whatever's biting, they'll have a little bit of bait for anything that's biting. And these are my volunteers, they help me put out stuff. How you doing? You want to take one of those cups, please? Help yourself? You too? Okay. So thank you very much. <laughs> and so we also like we marinate the marshmallows and garlic and flour so don't eat them don't let any kids eat them so we're here at El Dorado Park and we haven't been here in a year last year the event got postponed and I'm glad it's back on so we're working with uh, City of Long Beach the Parks and Recs Department and Fish and Wildlife is here Brian Young's here with Fishing in the City program and combination thing we do together Brian's group handles all the loaner rods and they do the educational part with the learning station. And then our foundation does all this stuff that you see way back there, the registration, we have the bait station, we'll feed the kids afterwards, and we do the drawing and stuff. And then the public's all here, it's all free. Um, it's open to kids any age, up to age 15. As a rule, we kind of say five to 15, just because we don't want somebody in a, with a baby in a stroller, and say the kid's fishing. So that's basically it. 
uh, till one o'clock. It's kids only at this lake. And today the lake got stocked with both catfish and rainbow trout. So hopefully the kids will start catching fish soon. It's a beautiful day. It's the Saturday before uh, Thanksgiving, November 22nd, 2014. Weather's gorgeous, not a, any chance of rain today. We have clouds in the sky, but no chance of rain, just a beautiful day. So I'm gonna walk around the lake here in a little bit and see if the kids catch some fish. So are you going to have coal for dinner tonight? Yes. We're going to eat it for dinner. Just wait until he tastes as good. Can I touch him? See you, coal. <laughs> touch him. <laughs> so this is Debbie and her husband Ron is a board member. And Debbie's the one that bought the bike. So we're going to let her give it away. So before you get mad at Debbie for not picking your number, let's say thank you, Debbie. Thank you, Debbie. <laughs> okay, Debbie's brand new best friend is 3160. Right here. All right, thank you guys very much. Thank you, City of Long Beach Park and Rec. Thank you, Fish and Wildlife. Thank all the parents. And thank you all for coming. Well, this is a wrap up of our fishing event today. We had a great time. Showed you yesterday the setup, all the work it takes to put on one of these events. And then we were here early in the morning setting up the rest of it, you know, all the forms out and all the flyers up and everything, banners and all that. And right now, as we wrap up the event, the kids are getting their food. We feed everybody, the kids and adults today. We have over 300 hot dogs. We had just under 300 kids register, so we're feeding everybody. We want to take any food home with us. We want to give it all the way here, let everybody enjoy it. In a couple minutes, we're going to have a drawing. We'll be giving away um, 12 or 15 rods and reels. We have a bike that was donated by one of our foundation board members. We can give away that too. Got some other prizes too. And that's how we end every event. So this is uh, me, Dan Hernandez, just saying uh, I hope you enjoyed watching today's little video blog and give you a good look at what it's like here at one of our free kids lake fishing events. Hopefully you can bring your kids, grandkids to one of these events or if you are a kid, have your parents bring you down. They're always free and they're always a lot of fun like you saw today. Well thanks for watching and I'll talk to you real soon.